Welcome to another episode of Stitch and Bitch. And yeah, I'm wearing the same shirt of the previous episode of Stitch and Bitch. And you know, I ended that video saying this did not go well. I could not talk about a thing and Stitch. But I have another TV show I want to talk about. And I feel like this is the perfect format for me to do that. So, and like this Carly Rae Jepsen shirt is great. So like I could have tricked you by wearing another shirt. But like, let's just, just revel in Carly Rae Jepsen. And the show I'm going to be talking about today is Anne with an E which was on CBC, but if you're not Canadian, it is on Netflix, I believe. Anne with a D is about Anne of Green Gables, and Shirley, and I love Anne of Green Gables. If you have watched any of my previous videos, book-related videos, you'll know that. I love Anne of Green Gables. I did not read Anne of Green Gables when I was a kid, sadly, but I did read them within the last couple years, and I love them. They have my heart forever and ever. And I, this is the first TV show movie about Anna Green Gables that I've watched. I mean, I've watched Avonlea, but that's like about the people of Avonlea, not Anne, when I was a kid. But anyways, again, can I, another Canadian show. So Anne with an E follows Anne. And this show, the first episode is an hour and a half or maybe two hours, I don't remember. The rest are all an hour in length. But the first episode, I was so just in love with it. I was like on the edge of tears because of happiness and also because the show can get very um, sad and dark but I feel like it works within the tones of the show and the tone of Anna Green Gables although Anna and Green Gables is a very like happy upbeat series and book. I think Aunt, if you like look at Anne's past and where she came from there's going to be darkness there and I think that show portrays it um, in a really great way and I love this show so much. I'm so happy that exists. The girl that they got to play Anne is wonderful and perfect and Marilla, everyone, everyone is just wonderful. Gilbert is great and there's seven episodes and I don't know if they've announced that there's going to be a second season but there has to be because it was so good. I'm interested in watching the other Anne series. I know there was another recent one that I haven't really heard anything about. The only thing I heard that it wasn't that good, but it's with Martin Sheen, um, and I like Martin Sheen. And I, there's the 1980s, it came out in the 80s, Anna Green Gables 1 2, which I know a lot of people like. So you need to watch Anna Green Gables. The girl that plays Anne is perfect. The show is perfect. Yes, it is dark but I think it works within the show, um, so don't let that stop you. I mean, I think it works perfectly. It, it stays kind of close to the book. It does do different things, but I think it has the essence of Anne. And again, I made no stitches, but I think I did a better job of explaining. But like, these videos are never supposed to be like very informational. It's not the word I'm working, looking, was looking for, but that works. They're just supposed to be me being, ah, this show is great, you should watch it, and being like super excited about it, and like also stitching, so there's like another reason of why I'm just like informally gabbing about something. Ooh, the stitches are not straight. Anyways, so, you should watch it with a knee, and come back and tell me how right I was, or if you've already watched it, then let's shout about it in the comments. Bye, guys.